Meanwhile, back at headquarters, strange happenings were afoot. You called Willie? Uh, no, I called you, and it's about time you showed up. Sorry, Mr. Lowen, I won't let it happen again. I? You haven't got one, and stop staring at me like that. You act as if you've never seen one of these before. Oh. Cute, ain't it? But that isn't why I called you here. Steve, we have a serious problem on our hands. You mean these boots? No, a larger situation. It seems a wicked band of nasty men have been dropping large engine blocks on unsuspecting citizens all across this thriving metropolis. Hmm. What? Oh, I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention. You idiot, engines are plummeting from the sky. Oh, you mean... Like lawnmower size? Worse. Six cylinders, V8s, turbines, nitro-burning funny cars. It's really gotten out of hand. Oh, I must do something to stop this madness. But how? I don't know. You're the guy that's part computer. You figure it out. Hey, back off, man. I'm bionic. Oh, shut up and get to work before I dock your pay. Yes, sir, Willie Loman. If my instincts are right, I might be able to stop this auto madman in time. Get the hell out of my office. You're sneaking up the place. Yes, sir. I'm off. Stupid cyborg. <laughs> oh! Using his bionic speed, Steve races across town. Pretty cool, eh? Duh. David, I am Turtle David. Go, 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 go. Huh? <laughs> ah! Yay! Huh? Uh-oh. <laughs> Those people are in trouble. I must save them. <laughs> huh? I better get out of here. Is everybody okay? Well, I'm fine. I'm pretty cool. I feel as fresh as a daisy. Oh, an engine block, just like the one Willie Loman was telling me about. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes, only I, Captain Gravity, can strike such fear into the hearts of men. But we need more variety, Kong. Here, try this Jeep. <laughs> oh, excuse me, what are you doing to my tree? Tarzan, kiss the soil, eh, boy? Huh? Whoa! Oh. I've got to stop this madness. Don't make a move, medical man, or I'll teach the hobby horse how to fly. Oh, Mr. Ed. Listen to what he says, Steve. He's serious. You don't scare me, Captain Gravity. Hey! <laughs> Viva la France! Le growl. <laughs> Willie, I ran into some problems. What? You again? Let me guess. The big bad bionic boy has got a boo-boo. No, my arm's been ripped off. Let me see that. <laughs> Don't bother me with your personal problems, Steve. I've got my bowels to move. Sorry, Willie. They were tougher than I thought. Tougher? What, are you blind? Well? You're bionic, you schmuck. But no, no, you have to use your powers for good. You have to help humanity. Well, to hell with humanity. Go clean up your mess. A gun? Yes, a gun. Now go blast him away and get it over with. And when you're finished with that, you can cut my lawn. Hmm. <laughs> I see you're back for more expensive guy. Not much more, you big loser. <laughs> Tough guy, eh? Tough enough to face Kong, eighth wonder of the world? <laughs> oh, no! They got the Willy! Oh, no, I have mercy on little Willy. Somebody help me! Gee, why'd you do it, expensive guy? Well, son, the more things change, the more they stay the same. Technology, bionics, women, they're cool and all, but there's nothing that beats the feel of a warm gun in your hand. Gee, could I hold it? Ah, heck sure. Why, I'll even teach you how to catch bullets with your teeth, little Billy. Wow! Gee, I'm real sorry, expensive guy. Oh, that's okay, son. Just remember to aim at my face next time. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>